YouTube, what's up you guys? It's your boy D Sauce and I'm back with another banger. Okay. Now, today I went out fishing and I caught some perch and some some barfish. We you know, we did a little I did a little damage, you know what I'm saying? But uh yeah, today I'm gonna show you guys how to fillet a perch. Now, me personally, I like a good size perch so you know that it got more meat on there and the fillet pretty good. You know, you don't want nothing too small with, I mean, you can if you want to, but we use throw like the lit babies back, you feel me? But, uh, slap, <laughs> that's the meat on that ball. So we gonna show, I'm gonna show y'all how, how I fillet these fish and get them cooking and I'm talking about, I'm talking about good, you feel me? So let's get to it. Boy, what is that? What dad brought home? Fish? Yeah, you get so excited when dad bring home fish. What? Is, oh, look at that slab, bud. Oh my gosh. <laughs> slab daddy, huh? You see, what is that? What is that? Fish? He love poking their eyes out. Stop. <laughs> Evil boy. Slap six seven <laughs> slap nine goddamn goo. I ain't want him. Ten. Ooh, look at that perchy perch. Look at the lead. <laughs> 11 look at that look at that slab boy goodness get him boy get him boy what is that what is that what number that is we the lost count y'all the lost count get him out of there boy get that perch out of there boy there we go boy <laughs> There we go. That's a, what number twelve. Get him out of there, boy. When you're done, you're get done. him out of there. When you're done, you're gonna clean, okay? I'm trying to cook, and y'all in here doing. Ooh. Oh my God, I can't get him, boy. I see why you're struggling. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> That's bigger than you. <laughs> I mean, he trying his best to get the fish out of there. Get him, boy. On the tippy on the toe. toe. <laughs> on the tippy toe. Yeah, baby, get him out of there, boy. Oh, you got him? You got him? <laughs> <laughs> get him out of there, Tay Tay. He's slipping. Get him. There you go. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Get him up there. Get him. Oh, oh what the back. He's too heavy. Catch a release. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, baby. That's that helper right there. Mm-hmm. I think that's it. That's it. Okay. That's a lot of cleaning. Clean up. <laughs> Clean up. The floor, the everything. The get in the bath. And the mo in the bite. All that. The sink, everything. You both clean. I think you got them all, boy. Oh, he ain't done yet. He found the perch, a perch. Is you finna hop in there? No, don't hop in there. Get him out of there, boy. Yeah. yeah, you need to go in the bath. Watch it. Grab him. Put him, put him up here. It's slippery. All right. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I'm done. Let me see. Okay, clean up. Oh, we ain't done. Oh we still gosh. got perch. We still got Lord perch to put up God. there, y'all. We still got perch and ball fish to put up there, man. I wasn't playing today. Oh, look at that slab. He came out the bottom. Oh, my goodness. All right, guys. Got our perch. Yes, sir. So what I do is I go behind this fin right here, lift it up. And if you got a weak stomach or, you know, you don't like guts and all that other stuff, you probably don't want to watch this video. But for all my fishermen out there that's trying to find out an easy way to fillet them, I'm gonna show you. 
All right, get your fillet knife and you lift that fin up. You hold, you hold that fin. So behind, behind where his gill at, where it lift up at, that's where you want to cut down to. So you cut it down there. Just like that. Now, as you cutting to the top, you go feel his spine. And it's gonna stop you from cutting it. So at that that point, you wanna turn your knife sideways down his back. So you wanna cut along his back. You go feel his spine. So you just cut along it. I'm gonna turn it this way so you guys can see. Right down the spine. Right on side of his spine, really. So, get a cutting like that, and then I kind of just break my way down. Just like that. All right, look how that meat just came up. So, keep going down the spine, right? I promise it's simple. Once you get to doing it. Once, you, once I get down to the to the tail of the, of the fish right here at the end of that last fin on the top you go pierce it all the way through to his, to his stomach on that side and you just work your way back down this and, and press down kind of press down kind of throughout this tail that's the way I do it so boom it just come up just like this okay yeah now you just take your knife and just kind of work it. Break it down. Right. And when I get to his stomach part, now his stomach is on this side. So I kind of just rake it from the top over the stomach. Right over the stomach. You gonna feel you gonna feel that that bone and just break it over it and I just cut it from there. So. Cut it straight off his stomach. And it should look just like that. Boom. Just like that. See his stomach. So remember, guys, behind the uh, the, the uh, gill, lift it up behind the gill. You cut, and you go follow that baby all the way down this spine. Here, when you get to here, you push your knife all the way through, and you slice the rest of it, like turning your knife down though, and you go slice it off. Okay. Then you just rake your way down to here. Then you go over the stomach. You go, you gotta, you gotta kind of play with it. You gotta lift it up, and then work your way over the stomach. And then you just cut from here all the way down here. Just cut it off. And there go your fillet. So once that's done, a lot of people when they do it, they'll just do it that way, and then they'll just keep it going on the opposite side. But you know, for you beginners that want to look for an easy way to fillet it, um, that's, that's the best way. So when you get to uh, your fillet, you hold the tail like this, and you go kind of scoop it up from the tail. So hold your tail and kind of angle your knife down so you can kind of scoop up the meat. Now, as you holding the tail, you want to be pressing down with your knife. Press, press down with your fillet knife and just, you know, slide it out. It's gonna come straight off. Boom. It's simple, guys. Simple, there go your fillet. So wash it off. Wash it off real good. Clean the rest of, or flip the other side. Do the same thing on the other side. Lift it up behind the gill. 
all the way down. You go follow that spine all the way down. I do the raking, rake it all the way down. You go feel the spine. And you wanna rake it close to the spine so you can get all the meat out. So when you get to the end of the, the fin, you go pierce it all the way through. See, I'm at the end of the, the fin right here. Push it all the way through to the other side. Boom. And just work my way back. raking technique along the spine just rake it down then we go go over the stomach remember the stomach is here so you kind of want to go over it and then cut it out so I lift it up like that but sometimes what, what works for me I even pull it if you just pull it off like that just come straight over the stomach and just cut it off. Just like that. There go your meat. Same thing, guys. Grab the end of it. Kind of scoop it up with your knife. And move it back and forth all the way as you pull it with the tail. Look how that boy just come out there. Hey man, it's, it's simple, bro. Simple. Just like that. And I do that with all the fish, uh, the big fish anyways. I like my filet. Some people like to cook theirs whole, you know, they'll chop the head out, get all the guts out of there, and they'll eat it like that, just peel it off the bone, but if you want filet strips like that, I mean, where you ain't even got to worry about no bone, that's, that's, that's the best way to do it. Then, you know, you can feed your kids and stuff like that, you ain't really got too much worry about bones, even though there might be some bones in there, so you probably want to check to make sure. You know, I can feel like I hit a couple bones. Just take them out or, you know, as you're eating, just watch out for, for the bones. But other than that, you won't have too much problem. You won't have too much problem with the bones. So, yeah, put your meat to the side. Clean it real good. We're going to go to the next part. All right, guys, this is part two of... The perchy perch. We try to cook these things, get them popping, get them finger licking you, and you hear me. <laughs> we trying to get these babies in. I'm talking about. Mm, 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 mm. I can taste it right now. First thing first, wash your hands. Get that bowl. Let them perch in there. Yes, sir. Got them in there. Now rinse your meat off. Rinse it off real good. That rinse it off pretty good. Next, you get your grease going. Get it, get it hot. All right, guys. You want to get your ingredients. So this what I use. I like to use tonus. A little slap your mama. <laughs> you gotta put a little slap your mama on there. Like garlic powder, garlic powder, and hot sauce. I like to use cornmeal. And I like to use the Louisiana fry. And you mix that and the cornmeal together. But I'm out of the fry, so I guess I'm gonna just use the cornmeal. And what we're gonna do 
first is season our meat. So let's season it. So first things first, drain all the water out. And we're gonna fill that boy up with that sizzle. And don't worry, it ain't gonna taste hot like how you think it is. That's just like when the way people put mustard on, you know, chicken and stuff. You don't even taste it. And just move it around in there. Very good. Tonus. Slap your mom in there. Mm -hmm. Add a little garlic powder. All right. That's it for the seasoning. These babies are going to be fire. Cornmeal, pour it in a container. Just like your frying chicken, guys. Just like your frying chicken. Smoked out in this boy, huh? <laughs> yes, sir. Man, them things finna be hidden, y'all. Taylor Gang cooking the sides. What we got for the sides, babe? Broccoli and mashed potatoes. Broccoli and mashed potatoes. The white perch. Mm mm mm. Love. So make sure they grease good and hot and ready. How you test it, you just grab your pinch of the, the uh, cornmeal. You drive it on there. See how that boy just is ready, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Got them boys in now. Keto Eat a Debbie while you're waiting. Eat your Debbie cake, the oatmeal pie. I look like one. Yeah, this way. Oh, back and forth, back and forth. Blue, chicken, blue. They play a little music while you got the perch on that grease, oh. on that hot grease down there. Watch out, real quick. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Got them cooking, y'all. Mm -mm -mm. Clean as you go. <laughs> Clean as you go. <laughs> Sir, you forgot that step. I think I got that bad. You got that bad. I got it bad. Terrible. You got it, you got it bad. When you cooking perch. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know what to say to that. Man, look at them boys. Y'all just don't know, man. Go out and catch y'all some perch. It's the best. Make sure y'all subscribe else. to my channel. Hit the like button. I only eat the perch. I, I like bass, too. No, I don't. Bass, perch. I got some bass in there. She don't know. But, yeah. Bass and perch. I catch them at least. They be hidden, man. Period. They be hidden, man. So, go out and catch y'all some fish. Like, share, subscribe. If my video has helped you guys, if it's entertaining, I'm doing it for you guys, man. Another banger coming y'all way. You did. Yes, sir. D sauce in the building. Make sure, make sure y'all follow your ball on Instagram at D E E underscore J22. Got them perch on the deck. You feel me? So, 
video coming soon how to catch these perch where to catch these perch what you need to do to catch these perch because i know everybody like white perch yes sir so uh stay tuned people stay tuned more coming your way let's go guys it's done I got some mashed potatoes as a side. I'm talking about get you some hot sauce, some ketchup. <laughs> Boy, you don't know what you're missing. Mm, look at that. Look at that. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. Y'all just don't know. Mmm. I'm talking about you. Mm. You ain't got to worry about no bones, no things, filet. Oh, man. Oh, man. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm perky, perky. Pass out after this meal. That's for sure. Mm. I know y'all want to watch me eat, but I know, I know one thing for sure. Them purse be hidden, man. That's why people keep them purse. Them purse be hidden. Clean meat. Mm, 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 mm. Look at this. Look at that. I know you want some purge right now. If you want some purge right now, hit that no, like no, button. No, 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 no. Mm, 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 mm. Boy. Comment down below how y'all cook y'all purge. What, what, what ingredients y'all use? And if the video helped you guys, subscribe to the channel because more bangers coming your way. These house in and out the building, baby. Let's go.